Good morning, fans, Privateer FX. Coming after you, coming at you on the Tuesday after the Masker Monday. Uh, risk on today. We talked about yesterday being capitulation. The market just got too bearish. Um, we're not out of the woods by any means, uh, but the market just got too bearish yesterday at that open and uh, you know limit down and all these people waiting on the offer and then limit down again and limit down again and limit down at the open it um, you know just smacked us of senseless selling instead of um, instead of uh, thoughtful selling let's just say that anyway turn around last night um, I and Euro 58 now well we've printed back down 32 the low um, don't mind the dinging we're just trading uh, some ES here uh, short side up near 50 so we're getting out of our longs and actually gonna go a tiny bit short here uh, might be a little bit of dinging here as we we screw around. Anyway, um, Euro looks like it's turned. Dollar Yen, big um, BOJ uh, intervention yesterday. Pushes us all the way back up to 105. We don't think this is going to get above 105.30 today, so we're working from the short side here. Um, a little bit late now, 104.68. We put it up on Twitter when we were up there. Um, Consolidation now looks like 104.30, 105.30 the rest of the day today. Uh, dollar yen. Uh, dollars are got banged down, but again, looks like capitulation. These bars, you don't want to get crazy now and be like, I want to own Czar and go home and buy a vacation home with Czar. Um, that's not where we are on this. You want to resell Czar somewhere between 50 and 40 and 50 and 60, but we're going to get consolidation now. Um, headless chicken shorts uh, are now getting squeezed. They're a little bit off balance. If you sold uh, 27 40s yesterday, 27 30s yesterday, uh, you're scrambling today. So we're just going to get consolidation in our minds. Take a look at this Kiwi. What the fuck is up with this chart? My God. There's nothing you can do with this chart. Like, honestly, if you sold the break at 62, you had three minutes to, to take profit. If not, you ended up losing. Uh, if you ended up getting long through 75, it was choppy as all hell. Uh, also, inevitably, probably a loser. Uh, I speak from experience. We tried to get long up here through 75 yesterday. Uh, frustrating, Kiwi. What the hell is wrong with that currency? Look at it just from a distance. Look at the breadth of that bar. Like, what the hell? Anyway, moving on. Gold, oh, we should be taking out some lows here. Oh, I didn't see that 52 the low already. Um, gold has some squeezing to do again you're off sides if you bought gold up here towards 1700 uh, this could be uh, relatively painful for the gold market um, no dog in that fight uh, where we do uh, where we are fighting here is uh, boons short boons short ZN yesterday um, this obviously looks pretty sexy now but the idea is basically this. Boons were at minus 85 basis points. We think they're worthless at minus 75. Um, you want to just play the short side of Boons uh, around here. So there's no harm in buying a couple of Boons back here, uh, getting your average above the hysteria point, because there's more negativity out there. Trust me. Um, this isn't going to be like a V-shaped bottom or anything. Inequities. Um, so, 
tactically trade this for your own sanity, for your own health. You don't need to push the chips uh, all the way in on this stuff. ZN, same thing. We think this is capitulation yesterday. Uh, unlike the rest of the market, we don't think 10-year notes are going to go negative. They're already at the hysteria point. Um, yesterday, they got down to 35 basis points. Keep in mind, on Friday, they were 70. It's a 50% move uh, in one day. So, sorry for the emotion in the voice. There's no, no reason for that. But we do think um, short, all fixed income uh, is correct. We will be reselling BTPs today, which is more risk off, I know, but there's going to be a big bounce in BTPs. We closed, um, we closed above the 130, 1.3% area yesterday. Um, so we'll be reselling this sort of between 176.50 and 177.50. That's on the June contract in BTPs. What else is out there? Dollar China, I really don't understand. It's just sitting here consolidating. Bitcoin, uh, big 15% move, most of it over the weekend. We bought yesterday um, at 82. I'm just sitting with this. Uh, it's, you know, we got whatever, 10 coins here, so it's, it's not the end of the world one way or the other. But we will be buying more core long Bitcoin as we've been talking about now for weeks we trade this from the long side um, tactically we trade this hold on we offer some spoos there um, tactically we trade this from the long side we do think uh, there will be support down here you see this is one major consolidation between six and twelve thousand we're obviously closer to the 6,000 side of this, uh, so we like Bitcoin longs. Dollar CAD, middle of nowhere. Uh, let's check on Sterling. Where did that sucker go? Tricky. We got budget coming out, I think, tomorrow, Wednesday. So this is going to be, uh, you know, obviously it's, it's secondary to this whole virus uh, global slowdown deal. Um, but should be negative sterling the the budget uh, tomorrow, so just be aware of that. Aussie in the middle of nowhere, same type bar as the Kiwi, ridiculous. Uh, Euro Swiss, you know, everyone's asking me about it. We know the SNB is down here at 106. They let it go down to to 105.43. It's untradeable. Longs are getting smoked. Shorts are getting smoked. My advice to anyone out there, well, number one is it's hard. Number two, it's an insider's market. Number three, when you see longs and shorts getting smoked, usually that means there's a turn. Um, when longs and shorts get smoked, usually means it's a turn. Um, but very very hard to trade my my general advice on euro swiss is is don't trade it uh just stay stay the hell away from it uh as far as a calendar today it's um let's see tuesday don't have too much french industrial production nobody cares um we have nothing. Italian industrial production, more lies. Uh, so nothing, nothing going on in the uh, on the calendar today. In general, we're just trying to be short um, short ES here, up near 20, 2850. Uh, and although tactically long on the in, in the big picture, right? So we think capitulation down at twenty seven hundred. We want to be tactically long, but trading this because there's a hundred handles on both sides of this. So rather than sit a hundred handles in the money, a hundred handles out of the money, uh, for your own sanity, trade it. And if you're not a professional trader, 
uh, stay away from it. Wait for um, bigger, bigger picture levels to uh, show themselves. Anyway, I've said enough here, people. Uh, have a good trading day, and uh, I will see you tomorrow. Course short, uh, fixed income, trading dollar yen, trading uh, yes. Ciao.